everyone, and welcome to another tech-related video. This is going to go under the playlist for 2009 Mac releases because today, on March, this is March 11, 2009, Apple has released, and I'll show you here, the new iPod Shuffle. Now, it's kind of hard to get a sense of the size of the iPod Shuffle, but I'm probably not going to play the guided tour because they might remove this video. But just to give you a comparison, this is the um, this is the much older iPod Nano here, the second to last generation iPod Nano. Okay, it's not that big. Then you have these iPod headphones right here. From what I've seen in these videos, the new iPod Nano is about the size of these headphones, from one end to the other. So it's a really, really small device, and you can see the person holding it in their hand. It's really, really small. It's about the size, smaller than, they say, a AA battery. So if you go to apple.com slash iTunes, you obviously have the new um, iPods. You can click on iPod Shuffle, and it comes in two colors. The one they advertise it in is uh, silver, but you also can get it in black. And I love the pricing. You can get a 4-gig iPod Shuffle for $79. So that's a great price. That's like, you know, they're trying to slim down the price of the iPod Shuffle because for the people who don't want to spend a lot of money on an iPod. So you can get up to 4 gigs, which is a 1,000 songs. That's very good. And they ship, They say they ship, I think they ship FedEx. So they're going to get it to you in 3 to 5 business days, which is all right. But, you know. Um, now, the really cool part is that it talks to you. Now, I was watching the video on how to exactly use this. They are actually, you can see by the picture, they removed all the buttons from the iPod Shuffle. So there's no buttons on it. The only way to actually... Uh, manipulate your music you can see number one on the top here there is a here's a headphone port and then you have three three notches the one all the way on one side would be the shuffle one or all, all the way on one side is to play your songs in a direct straight order the next one in the middle is shuffle and all the way on the other side is turning it off so you can have it on shuffle but then you have um, this little part here that's actually on your headphones. So it's kind of like the iPhone headphones without a microphone that you can actually change volume and everything. Um, from those you can uh, you hold it down for a certain period of time. There's certain actions like that Apple's built in. And if you do want to buy this you can obviously watch the video on this. So um, they're still selling the old iPod Shuffle for $49 for one gig which is you know it's it's not again storage is cheap so you can talk as as many gigs as you want and I'll I'll look into the price if you want but these are the complete specs specs so when they say navigation they're gonna say earphones with remote voiceover now voiceover is that when you actually hold down the middle of the headphones um, I have a pair of iPod headphones here but basically they're kind of tangled up if you hold down the middle of the headphones it'll like read out read out the name of the song for you hold it down a little longer let go and you can go through playlists. So this is the first iPod Shuffle with playlists built in. And obviously it's not available in all the colors, but that's pretty cool. Now, um, it says it includes earphones and a USB with the old one. The new iPod Shuffle comes with earphones with the remote on them and an iPod Shuffle USB cable. So it does still connect to your Mac or PC with USB. So um, you still get laser engraving. I mean, the, the really the only thing they're changing is look at that size. Look at the size comparison. It's not that much bigger than the headphones themselves. You can clip it. They have a little aluminum clip on the back. Let me see if I can find the, uh, the gallery for you because they actually have like an interactive 3D spin thing where you can actually spin around the iPod Shuffle. There it is. So that's pretty cool that you can do that. Yeah. That's pretty good. So they give you a whole bunch of... Um, uh, there's a little, there's a couple perks, so people might like to to mess around with the new iPod Shuffle. Maybe some people will be doing hands-on reviews of it. I obviously don't have one with me, but if I did, I would love to show you guys just how small this actually is. But that's basically it. So um, if you're looking to the, this is the, again, this will go on the 2009 Mac releases playlist, and you can check it out at apple.com slash iTunes. Peace.